All right, so I talk a lot about coordinated misinformation and purposeful deception that is being perpetrated against people. It is absolutely diabolical what some of these people are up to, and they're doing it openly. You can see it, you can read it, it's been out for years, but people aren't aware or they don't care, really. The first concept to understand is the Five Eyes Alliance. Now, this is an alliance between five English-speaking countries, America, Canada, Great Britain, New Zealand, and Australia. What's their purpose? It's intelligence sharing. Now, in America, Britain, New Zealand, these countries, there are pesky laws which prevent the government from spying on their own people. Now, if America were to spy on Great Britain and then share the information with Great Britain, that's called Five Eyes, baby. They have access to pretty much everything that is connected to the Internet. Now, in 2014, training documents created by British intelligence spread amongst the Five Eyes was published, which is essentially their modus operandi in this new Internet age. This was titled The Art of Deception, Training for Online Covert Operations. Now, these tactics were supposed to be used against cyber threats, but we should remember, it's the year of our Lord 2021. Cyber threat is very loose. We live in a year where Republicans are broadly labeled white supremacists, and as we all know, white supremacy is the greatest threat to our nation, where misinformation is terrorism. Pretty much anything against the status quo of the political elite is domestic terrorism at this point. And therefore, it's fair game. So let's look into some of the tactics that they prescribe to disseminate false information into online discourse in order to destroy the reputations of those they do not appreciate. This includes utilizing false flag operations, creation of fake victim blogs, as well as honeypots for the purposes of blackmail. Their other tactic is to utilize the social sciences in order to manipulate public discourse and activism to achieve desirable results. Let's look at gambits for deception. Let's just look at sense making right here. Exploit prior beliefs. Present story fragments. Repetition creates expectations. The haversack ruse, or the creation of false information for the purpose of deception. Swap the real for the false, and vice versa. Gee, I don't know, where have we heard any of these before? They have made manipulation and gaslighting deception, they have made it into a science. There are people sitting there for 10 hours a day mapping out how to absolutely destroy organizations, discredit people, ruin their lives. These guys aren't messing around. They aren't good guys. They aren't here for your protection. They are here to control every single aspect of your mind and how it operates. They are here to feed you bullshit information so that you'll be a good boy and do exactly what they want, what is desirable to them. And honestly, the scariest thing is that no one cares. We've known all this for seven years now. And while we do nothing, and while we don't care, these guys are in cubicles for 11 hours a day figuring out exactly how to absolutely brainwash, manipulate, and gaslight the entire human population. 